What's going on, vendors? Extreme Vending here. Um, I'm over at my brother's house grabbing his truck because I'm about to pick up a machine that's really far away. I got a big day ahead of me. Not only do I have to pick up a machine, um, I have to do a collection, and I have to show you guys an arcade that I have uh, been building, and I have to do a repair on a machine over there. So I don't know if this is going to be a two-parter or not, but there's a lot I have to do today and a lot of traveling, so... This, uh, this is going to be a long day for me, but it's uh, part of the business. So we're going to go ahead and go in the truck and head our way out. Finally, after forever driving, I am here to do my repair on a machine that I placed in here after the auction. It's a stackers machine. I needed a sensor. So I got my sensor, and uh, here's the arcade that I'm building. I'll show you. Hopefully it's opened. They were closed for two months. This location. Oh, they're not here. They said that they're going to be here. I'll call them up. Okay, so uh, they are closed for a few more hours. The guys in Phoenix, which is about a couple hour drive, he was trying to get some supplies for their kitchen because you know some of the stuff expired. But he told me in the back. He left the door open for me. Thank goodness, because I drove a long ways. <sighs> he said something about the back door. Listen. I think that's locked. Let's try this back door. That's... Definitely a lot. Well, uh, not having a good start so far. The owner of the arc or the uh, restaurant where I have my arcade said that they'll be up over there hopefully in the next hour or so. So I'm just going to go up do my collection here in Payson which is about a half an hour drive away from where I need to be but this is the fun part is collecting money and that, I'm at the movie theater which has been about two weeks do we have a red flashing light no we do not so it is working I figured out the problem I'm pretty sure oh that was heavy carrying all that was actually really heavy So this isn't flashing red. I think the problem was is I had the wire in the way and so it shoot the bill into the bill acceptor wire. I see a fiver. Oh, and I put some money in here before I left. Oh, I didn't even realize because I wanted to make sure before I left town. I forgot I did that, so that's even more cash. Let's see. Oh, man. Oh, and there was a 20. So, a tweeter. Let's see what it looks like with all the cash in there. There's quite a bit of quarters. I mean, this bucket is kind of deceiving. Go ahead and grab this cash. The money bag. It's probably better to do the quarters first. And I should probably do all the quarters. Hey, how's it going? A nickel. Now my coin mech right here, yeah, I got a part ordered in, but it's not accepting the coins, and so I'm just gonna get a different coin mech. Let's go ahead and grab quarters out of here. Hello. A few bucks, not too bad. Two weeks, like I said. And I think there's like 50 cents in here. No, I pulled it out already. No, I haven't. 50 cents in there. 
Not very many quarters. All right, back to the bills. We got all the quarters out of the way. There's that 20 I put in there. People really like this giant claw machine. Hey, wait. There's a second 20. So this is what I was talking about before. This wire right here, it was coming up around here and I just had to stuff it underneath so it would get the bill, shoot it, and it would catch this wire. And that's why I was uh, constantly getting jammed. This is the big machine. That's over $200 just from here. That's almost $250. Oh wow, that's like $5 away, so $245. Is that deceiving by the bag, or is that really what it is? Because I have a bag in here. There's some plush. Um, it's pretty full. I see a fiber. Oh. One. Two. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. Say on the ground for now. I'll get everything out. Oh my gosh. There's another fiber in there too. I think it's going to easily break 400. This will be a new record breaker. So far, we got in three twenties and a ten. Oh, the movie theater location! It's filling up my bag. This is the first spot. So two forty-five is where we're at. Check out this last. And then I'll get you the numbers of the minis. The 50 cent machine does okay, but nothing compared to what the bigger machines do, the dollar machines. We actually did like 417 last time. 105 away from 400. Ooh, 149. It's almost 150. So let's say 150 plus so that's 3, 444 all together. 444. We did break the record. You know, fifty dollars is still really good, especially if you think about it. This thing has to do double the play, you know. So that's like a hundred plays over here, and this one, which did about one hundred and fifty. So I mean, it is fifty more plays ish, but still not too bad.
that's really awesome for two weeks. And if you haven't already done so, make sure you click the subscribe button so you can keep yourself up to date with the latest content, guys. Thank you so much. On to Filiberto's, the second location. I think I'm gonna split it up here after this collection, just because my video is so long. But, Filiberto's. Hi, how's it going? There's a bit of a glare. Ooh, this looks good. That's locations at a month. Moment of truth. Oh, geez, that's really good. Almost 175, 160, uh, four, 174, 50. I'm going to conclude the video here. Um, this is part one. Obviously, part two will come out right after. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. And like I said, smash that like button and click the subscribe button if you want to see more content. And I'll see you around. Thank you guys for supporting me. Bye.